hello hello everyone welcome to my channel i am carolise and this is the place for you to get all your information about business analysis and how to grow your career in this field so today i want to give you a video that's really like an update of what's been going on some things that are coming out and i want to celebrate some people that have had success in the business analyst career of recent and they have sent me messages and I just want to give them a shout out. So let's go into that first. I want to just take a little time to celebrate my girl Jay, right? I'm not going to give you her full name, but my girl Jay, she had an interview coming up for a business analyst job and she was a little bit nervous because even though she had transferable skills, she was working for many years um, in support and she's very good at that troubleshooting all those things but she's never worked as a business analyst before and she was a little bit anxious about the interview that she had coming up was a huge company had lots of benefits a great job and she really wanted to land that job right also in her in her case um she had gotten laid off from a job before and she's been out of a work for a couple months so you can understand the pressure and the just wanting to get a new job and start something fresh and get back in the field and not feel all that anxiety so she reached out to me she found me somehow on youtube she found my website she went on the website and she found so much value from what i was putting out there she reached out to me she booked an appointment because i now have consultation sessions so i can help you if you need specific information and my consultations are always one-on-one -on -one. so i'm giving you what's you know what you need for your problem because everybody doesn't have the same problem right say so what wherever you know that you're weak that's where i focus on and i try to help clear the fog and help give you the information for you to be confident so she booked a session with me and normally in my sessions i have uh, like a pre like a discovery call a pre-call basically and that's for her or anybody to explain what they're struggling with and what they need help with so that I can take that and tailor my consultation to make sure it's gonna fit the, the challenges that you're having and give you insight on specifically what you need help with so we did that and she was lovely she was awesome and we had the session and I went through, I understood the job that she was applying for. I understood from her resume where she was weak, what the job was looking for, what she didn't have. And I was able to tailor the consult for her. And we had the session, we walked through, we did a little prep. And then she went to the interview. And so the morning of the interview, I sent her a message. I said, you got this girl. You can do this girl. <laughs> right? Just boost her up. Because sometimes, sometimes people don't have someone in their corner you know rallying for them rooting for them hoping that they get the job and be successful sometimes the family isn't even doing it right so i stood in the gap for the for her with that and it's just something i would do anyway um so she went to the interview and then after the interview she sent me a note and said well they asked a lot of situational questions so luckily we had prepped some situation questions like tell me a time when um explain when you know tell me explain to me when you had to make this decision things like that those are situational uh style questions so they asked her a lot of situational style questions and i said that's a good thing girl that is a good thing because it means that they're already convinced of your hard skills from your resume it means that they just want to see how you would react in these situations they don't care too much about if you can do the job because they already see that so she left the interview and a week or so passed and i you know i'm still rooting for her i'm hoping she gets the job and she sends me a message and she says guess who has the job <laughs> guess who got the job they offered her the position this is a person who has no experience as a business analyst this is the first time she's applying as a business analyst and she got the job beating out everybody else who was in the in the in the runnings for that job i'm just happy i'm just happy because i like when people even when they're scared they go out there and try they go out there and they do it and they do their best and they bring themselves to what they're trying to accomplish and if i can help you along that journey i will i'll be right there with you i'll be right there with you helping you right so i'm just so excited for her i'm so excited for her i'm happy she's now 
you know, she's going to start this role. It's going to be challenging. She might not know everything, but she's going to have the confidence that she can do it. Right. And I have her as one example. I have another guy. He did not sign up for an appointment um, for a consultation. He just sent me an email and he had some very specific pointed questions um, for his interview coming up. And he was a little bit nervous because he's never worked in business analyst either. Um, and so I responded to him and gave him some pointers and I didn't hear from him again. So I was like, maybe i don't know if it worked or not so i just gave him some some generic for me it's just general information but for him it was really valuable and this was really going to help him and so i think like three weeks passed by and then i get a message from him that says i got the job i was like yes champagne champagne <laughs> look when you guys get jobs and you send me that message whether on my facebook or on my instagram or on a youtube comments or in my email, look, I am. I have a reason to celebrate, okay? I have a reason to celebrate, and I do, I celebrate you. I just don't make a video every time. Today I'm making a video of it. So he says, you know, he's still nervous. He thinks that he just did well in the interview process, and he feels like when he gets the job, he's gonna be like really out of his depth. But I told him, calm down. You, your resume got you to the interview. You performed well in the interview. Now when you go to the job, you're gonna perform well in the job too. Whatever you don't know, you're gonna find out. You're gonna go research, you're gonna go work towards. Okay, so I'm just happy for these people. I'm just so happy for these people who stepped out unsure, imperfect, not knowing what's gonna happen, but they stepped out, they applied for the job, they got the job in the end. And so if you look at some of my videos in the comments, I have people who say, I got the job, I got the job. I am so happy for you guys. And if you've watched my videos and I've given you anything that you thought was valuable in your interviews, and it has helped you to get the job, send me a note, right? Put it in the YouTube video, put it in the comments, because I want a reason to go drink my champagne, okay? I want a reason to enjoy and to, to be happy because I'm celebrating you, all right? So I just want you guys to be encouraged, all the people that are still looking for jobs, that you've been applying, that sometimes you've gotten a call back, sometimes you haven't, sometimes you've gone to the interview and done the interview and you don't know, you haven't gotten a response, Keep in the fight, keep in there. You're going to get a job, right? You're gonna get a job and if you wanna be in the business analysis space, now is a great time to be in that space. As a matter of fact, I am coming out with the business analyst job market report. That will be available, I would say, within the next week or so. And that has been a research I've been working on to see what is the job market like for business analysts? What are some of the things employers are asking for? And this is not just a US based report. So I'm looking at the US, for example, and saying which states are having the most business analyst job offerings. I'm looking at Canada, which provinces in Canada has the most business analyst jobs. I'm looking at India, I'm looking at Australia. And so I'm looking at these geographical regions and I'm going into depth as to what's the salary like? What are the skills that you need? What are the tools employers are asking for? Um, what is the alternative careers that you could use your business analysis skills to get? Maybe you wanna be a business analyst, you wanna to go to the next step, what is that next step? So there's a number of questions I'm answering and I'm answering it with empirical statistical data. So this is not a survey of people who are working in the field, it's really, what are employers looking for? So I'm looking at it from the employer's perspective so that you can come into the job market and know what your employers are expecting. Okay, that's gonna be available within a week or so. It's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna put it on my website. You're gonna be able to download it and you know it's gonna be a paid offering so you're gonna to have to pay for it because this research took a lot of time and effort and um, a lot of data that had to be collected to be able to bring you this information. So it is a paid offering, but it's gonna be immensely valuable, especially if you're just starting your business analyst career, or if you're in your career and you wanna to go to the next level, or you wanna switch your job, it's gonna be immensely valuable because it's gonna give you from the employer's perspective. What is employer looking for? What are the salaries they're offering at a different experience level, right? So this is gonna be great information. Nobody else in the market has this. So look out for that. And continue to send me messages, continue to look at my website because I do put new things out there that I don't always um, mention during the, the YouTube videos. Um, 
So if you have done an interview, please, 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 right? Come back and if you've done an interview that you found that my videos have helped you to, to be ready for the interview, let me know. I want to hear these things. I want to hear these success stories. I want to drink some more wine, okay? Put in the comments on my YouTube video that you found the most useful for your interview um, or you can just send me a note. It'd be great. So look out for the, the business analyst job market report and also please let me know when you had some success based on the information I've been sharing. Well, that's it for today, guys. Thank you all so much. I'm gonna go upstairs now and get my bottle of wine and start doing all my Friday evening things, right? Because <laughs> it's the weekend. We gotta enjoy ourselves, so we work really hard during the week. Weekend, fun time. Play hard, work hard, right? So that's what we're doing. So thank you guys for watching this video. I thoroughly enjoy creating videos like this for you and creating content that's useful to you and helping people change their lives.